All right. Hey, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. <laughs> it's me, Nicholas. And today we're gonna be going through my nighttime skincare routine. I got a lot of comments asking for <laughs> No, I actually I didn't get any comments asking for this. I actually share this totally uninvited on my Instagram all the time. Um, but I figured I would actually make a YouTube video about it just because I didn't know like what else to make a YouTube video about. So I just got out of the shower, as you can see, because I'm wet. And when I'm in the shower, I use this face wash. It's from Trader Joe's. I really like it. It's a tea tree oil face wash. Um, obviously, like, I don't wear makeup, so I don't know how it would work on that. Um, but I feel like at the, when I get out, like, my face is really clean. And I live in New York, so the air is, like, very filthy and disgusting. So when, like, you actually, like, wash off, like, all the particulates on your face, it feels very good. All right, so let's open this bitch up. This is my cabinet. So after I wash my face, I do an exfoliant. So I don't do this every day, but I would say like most days I do it. It's pretty gentle, so I think it's okay to use, um, you know, multi multiple times a week. So we just gotta put that on there. Some right here, some right here, some right here, you know. Close that up. This is the L'Oreal Pure Sugar Scrub Exfoliant Sucre Pure. That's what it's called. I think that means um, pure sugar in French. And you just rub it in. I didn't actually pay for this product, so I don't really know how much it costs. I got it from a friend. But it smells really good. You can put it on your lips too. I normally do because I'm kind of crusty, so I gotta get that off. It tastes like watermelon. It actually tastes really good. I don't think you're supposed to eat it, but like it is very tempting to eat because it smells and tastes delicious. Like it kind of has a soapy taste, but I'm kind of a psycho, so I kind of like it. Okay, so when you rub it all in, your face will look like this. All right, and it's not time sensitive. So you just rinse it off. I always exfoliate with cold water just because Pharrell told me to. And I'm, I don't know if Pharrell is a vampire or if his skin tips work. He says that his key to success is exfoliating with cold water every single day. Like exfoliate cold water. Um, I don't know. But I'll just follow it just in case, you know? All right, now I'm just gonna pat my face dry with my towel. Some people say that you should use like a paper towel when you dry your face and you probably should, but that just seems like so bad for the environment. I already do so many other terrible things. I figured that I'm not using a paper towel every time I wash my face, which is like twice a day is probably one of the things I can do to like offset my whole, my other horrible habits. All right, so next I'm gonna put on some toner. I use this. So this is facial toner, witch hazel, aloe vera formula, rose petal, alcohol free. Um, it has water, glycerin, which is a humectant. It's good for hydration. It's a water, glycerin, witch hazel, um, aloe, um, Phoenix and Dell, I don't know what that is. Rose, flower water, fragrance, natural rose, um, citrus acid, citrus grandies, uh, which is grapefruit. It's a lot of good hydrating stuff in there. I actually started using witch hazel a long time ago. Before, I guess it was like popping. Yeah, I guess I started using it before it was popping. Then I started using whatever rose water blew up. I was using rose water. 
I was like, why am I doing this? And now I guess I got the best of both worlds. So now, since it's my YouTube show, I'm gonna do something a little bit special. My friend for my birthday sent me this face mask. Well, they sent me they sent me a couple, um, and I've been using them. And normally, I'm not like a face. I I've, I've never used like these sheet masks. I think I've used them like once before, never like regularly, because I was like, how much value could this really be adding? But lately, I've been doing a little bit, a little bit more research and like about serums and like all this like other type of stuff. And so basically, like the sheet mask is just like a serum. It's just like on the mask. Um, and people use them every single day. I did not know that. So I've been using them not every single day, but maybe like every other day. And it actually does make a huge difference. I'm not, I'm, I'm not gonna fucking kid you. It makes a huge difference. Like, if you're a person who really, I really pay attention to my skin because you know I have this whole thing about how like, if the, the better you look, the better people will treat you, and like the more opportunities you'll get. So like. If you have like I need to shave but it's like if you are like clean shaven you have a fresh edge up if your skin looks good if you look like not necessarily you don't have to be like skinny but like if you look like healthy like in shape and like your your nails are, are manicured and you just you just look good people will treat you better that's like that's not even like pseudoscience like that is fact so s skin is something that we actually have a lot of control over um, like the way that our Unfolding these is always so hard because you don't want to tear it. But like the way that our skin looks, we actually have a lot of control over it, but we don't, a lot of people don't really pay attention to it. Thus, it is something that you can kind of get ahead of people, kind of like, because people just like aren't noticing, they aren't paying attention. Like, I don't know if that makes any sense. But like, I'm like trying to unfold this right now, guys. Like basically, a lot of people don't take care of their skin. Thus, in the game of appearances, if you are taking care of your skin, you're like getting ahead of them because that's one more thing that you're doing to make yourself look more, you know, outstanding than they are doing. So it's definitely a good thing to take care of. And it's something that people notice about you, whether they notice it or not. Like they might not think, they might not look at you and be like, oh my God, your skin is amazing. What was your routine? What are you doing? Like they may not even know that they care about it, but when they look at you, like if they were just looking at you versus a picture of you with acne or with dry dehydrated skin, like they were always gonna choose the hydrated one, the healthy one. They're always gonna choose that over the not healthy one. Hmm. I got kind of a big face. So these masks, this is like, this one actually fits the best of all the ones that I have. I know it doesn't stick right here because I have like facial hair, but if I didn't, it would be sticky down. Ooh, looks kind of sexy, huh? Oh yeah, I like that. Ooh, giving you Zodiac killer vibes. You already know the vibes. All right, so I'm gonna chill and let this dry. Um, you can just rub that into your hands. Um, put some lotion on and just hang out probably for like, I guess maybe like 15 minutes um, while it all soaks in. So be right back. All right, y'all, so I'm back. So we're gonna take the mask off. It's like pretty damp right now. As you can see, it's not like dripping anymore. And we'll just kind of rub it in. Get over her neck. I said our neck as if we're sharing the neck. We're not. So I have this um, Tarte Maracuja C Brightener uh, treatment. Um, this is good stuff. Um, I got it again. I got it from a friend who did um, like a like she was like sponsored by Tarte, so she had a bunch of Tarte stuff, and she was just like, "Do you want to try this?" I was like, "Yeah, I'll try it." And I actually really like it. I'm not gonna front. I don't know all the science behind it. It could totally be a placebo. That's that's totally an option. But since I've been using it, I definitely like. I wake up in the morning and I look more awake. I look more alert. I look more refreshed. Like it claims to brighten eyes, and honestly, I think that it really does. 
maybe I just believe that I'm gonna wake up looking more fresh and so therefore I do. Honestly, I couldn't tell you, um, but I think it works like a charm, honestly. All right, so the last step is gonna be this Laniage uh, water sleeping mask. So this is a really good sleeping mask. It really has, like, it really hydrates. <laughs> I'm just thinking, let me, I'm just thinking my mind, like, you know, like, with some dermatology vocabulary. It really hydrates. It really is a mask. It really does hold everything in. All the serums and stuff that were in the mask and all this stuff that was in the toner and everything. And the face wash, like, all the good nutrients and stuff are all getting sealed in. No cap. So, yeah. And then brush here. 